Hi homesteaders, DIY enthusiasts. Uh, today's project is a plow for my uh, my uh, ranch truck here. Um, this old plow uh, was on another vehicle, two other vehicles in the past, and uh, so I have to change it. I had to bend it a little bit to make it fit the frame. And I also had to add these brackets, and I had to uh, add some other supports um, to make sure it would fit. Uh, once I welded those on, then I had to just get it into place and jack it up. It's not so much that it's super heavy, but it's just a little awkward with all the weight in front like that. So um, getting it lined up so that the holes meet up and I can slip pins in there and bolts uh, required a little fiddling around. In this case, uh, two car jacks, little floor jacks, worked out pretty well. I could I could get them in the right spot and work each one and wiggle it back. Now that it's on, the next thing would be to take the plow and mount that. It just slips right in. There's a couple pins that hold it, and the chain hooks onto the, the hook there at the top of the cylinder, and that raises and lowers it. I got the plow on. Um, the problem with this plow initially was that the uh, hydraulic unit here um, was broken, and it didn't work very well, and then it's also it's an old style one that had a pump. Um, the pump. That, this was the last pump. Um, had two hoses. I was able to use one of these hoses, um, but this was a uh, fan belt driven. Had a pulley here. There was no way to fit that into the. There was no way to fit that into the into the, the engine compartment here. There's just too much stuff going on there. So I ended up uh, using. I ended up using um, one of the old hoses here. It just goes down to the cylinder, just the lifting cylinder, so it doesn't have side to side. Mainly I just need up and down. Um, I'm going to pretty much keep it at this angle. I have this hose going uh, to this convenient opening I made in the door here. <laughs> uh, it's not roadworthy anymore, this vehicle. And then I can open the door with my, oh, also, my convenient aftermarket latch mechanism after my uh, door uh, lock broke. Um, so the hose comes in here and then I bought one of these, a single action um, hand pump so I can sit in there and give it a few pumps and pump it up. And this is the uh, release valve that when it came it was broken so I had to put something else on there. So I turn this, tighten it up, pump it. When I want to lower the, the blade, I release it. Well, let's give it a try. We got a little snow on the ground. Might as well give it a try. Looks like my plow feet are up a little, uh, down a little too low. These are the plow feet here. Uh, I just have to take that off and remove some of the washers, bring it down lower. But it's definitely pushing snow, um, just not as low as I wanted. There's not much snow here anyway, but I just wanted to test it. I think I would call that a unqualified success. Nobody's watching. Thank <laughs> you.